Thank you. Um, so I'm Erica from Coeur d'Alene. All three of my children have been in the Coeur d'Alene School District. My oldest is here. Um, my senior graduated last year at CHS and my daughter's a sophomore. Um, I have spent thousands of hours volunteering in the school system, so I've supported the school system for a very long time. Um, what you guys have taught in elementary from elementary is if there's a problem, you go talk to an adult or a staff. And what's really sad to me is Julie did that and you guys didn't help her. You left her feeling unsafe and unsupported. The ROs, I love both of you. Your job as a police officer is to serve and protect and she did not feel protected. And so you have students exactly what she said. My daughter, who's a sophomore, went to the bathroom about a month ago and there was a male and a female in there totally doing their thing, making out it was a very unpleasant sight that shouldn't be in the bathroom. Did my daughter tell you guys? Nope. Do you know why? Because she knows that you're not going to do anything. So you're teaching our kids to tell and tell somebody, but you're leading the opposite example. You're not setting an example. And like I said, I've, I've totally trust edu or supported education, but you guys are failing. And for you guys to wait for others in Boise to lead, why? You're not teaching our kids to make a stand and lead others. You're just waiting for somebody else to make laws while you have done nothing but teach these kids that they're not respected, but they need to respect you, but you don't respect their feelings. And I applaud Julie and the other students that have said something. I applaud their parents because they've raised strong children, but you guys aren't, and it's very, very sad. And knowing my daughter the other day she's a very strong independent woman and she was in tears of the garbage she deals with at school and it says right in your guys's guidelines that they are to go to school with no interruption what is the exact words I have on my phone for education and it's not happening they're having to deal with all this other stuff and we trust you and some parents can't homeschool their kids or have that capability and so we put that in your hands and it's unfortunate that I've always supported the levy every single time, but it's really unfortunate that parents feel that they can't support the education because of all this other stuff going on and something really needs to be changed and not wait until Boise does something. My daughter's afraid to go to school. That poor Julie, every time she goes in the bathroom, she's either gonna be afraid of what she sees or the fact that she's not supported. And so you need to ask yourself what message you're sending to all of our students. Thank you.